The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Here for the Eagles Sports Network, I'm Brian White with head women's soccer coach Sam Duffy. Coach, you received the news about your all-conference honors. Um, you see six players be named to different teams with Emily Futrell and Addie Henry on the first team, a uh, trio of Eagles on the second team, and your goalkeeper, Lily Ebner, and on the honorable mention. Talk about what it means to have six players on a all-conference honors in a season like this one. Yeah, I'm just happy for the girls overall, to be honest. Going into the season, personally as a coach, I was, ju I was just hopeful that we'd get at least one of the games in. And Because um, again, you don't know if the rug's going to be pulled out from underneath you at any moment, just with the, with the testing um, and, and COVID protocols. We got shut down once this year, and, and after that I was very sceptical if the games would go ahead. So, first off, just happy that we got to play. Um, but really, really happy for, for the players that, that represented and, uh, on, on, on each of the all conference teams. And for Emily, this is her third straight year being honored. Um, she's also named the Offensive Player of the, the Year, yeah. which is a big honor. Um, talk about what, she, what you saw from her this year that landed her these special honors um, as she We'll come back in the fall. Yeah, well, first off, we're glad she's coming back in the fall. And uh, now I, I've, I've, I've had the opportunity uh, to see Emily develop and mature and grow as a player over the last four years, and it's been fantastic. Um, she, she had, even as a freshman, she made an impact. But uh, just she's, she's grown a lot, and she's matured, and, and has, has really blossomed into a leader and, and a player, a go-to player as well. So she's a player that I can rely on, but... Just, just delighted for her to get that recognition as well. She work, works extremely hard, but I know um, she she has a, a good drive inside her now that she's going to hopefully going to push on and uh, hopefully come back in the fall even stronger and, and and ready to go. And you see, among the many honors, you see two freshmen, one at the midfield, one in the goalkeeper, land this all conference on it in their first season. So talk about what this can mean for their careers heading on, especially with them coming back for your program next year. Yeah, I mean, it, it just goes to show you we, we, we had a couple of freshmen, two or three freshmen, start and play a whole lot of games. So I said it to you last night after the game, the future looks bright. And when you've, when you've got a player like Emily Futrell coming back and just got that honor, the same as a Wadey and a Magda Masengo in the past, and then you've got the freshmen coming in and, and, and playing a whole lot and improving a whole lot. But when you've got the likes of, you know, Emily and Yenta and Tina and these older players to, to kind of learn, learn the trade from and learn things from, the, the future looks bright again because I'm really, really thankful for the players for the, for the, for the effort put forth, Every, everything they've done with, with the circumstances we had. Very proud of them. But the future looks extremely bright. You know, we've got essentially the entire team coming back, and we've a few really special additions that we're going to be adding. So, it, it was tough in this season, looking on the sideline and seeing so many long-term injuries. But again, trying to put things in perspective and look at the fall, we're we're really thankful and and just very optimistic about the fall. All right, thanks, coach, Thank and congrats you. on having six players named to All Conference honors. Appreciate it for the Eagles Sports Network. I'm Brian White here with head women's soccer coach Simon Duffy.